Uh, let me, let me, let me, uh... Wait, what? What was that? What did I just salvage? Well, it's gone. <laughs> I, <laughs> I might have just salvaged something really good, but well, I mean, it's gone. It is what it is. It's gone now. It's gone now. It's gone now. If it was something good, well, you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. Hello, hello. We are back at it again. Good morning. It is time for Diablo. It is very early. I've literally just gotten up. Oh my god, the music is so loud. It is time to conquer the hells of Diablo. There we are. So, I mean, as I've been saying, there is no debate here. Like, straight up. There is no debate to be had here. I'm playing a barbarian and I, I don't even care about the rest. I mean, everyone see the druid memes. Maybe I'll play the druid sometime down the line. I think it could be co uh, cool to play a sorcerer as well. Necromancer is also pretty badass. But let's be honest. I'm, I just care about a barbarian. We'll do that. We'll do green eyes. Uh, face variations. I can't see his face. Which one was the hair? I, not bald. Uh, I think I went with that hair last time. I'm pretty sure I went with this. This is badass. Alright, so let me, let me look at the faces. Uh, facial hair. I want the biggest beard they have. There we go, that's the biggest beard, I remember. I don't think there was a bigger beard than that. Yep, that's the biggest beard. Uh, we're gonna have black and white. No, I just want- I just want black. There we go. Great. Great. Uh, markings. Do we want markings? I think I had these the last time. The markings are cool, but I don't want them on my face. This looks pretty badass. I'm gonna go with this. Markings color, ink tattoo, blue paint. Let's do ink tattoo. That looks- that looks the best. Uh, jewel- jewelry. Do we want anything? I remember that there were the- the big wacky, um... These ones, yeah, this is like, shut up, I'm playing Diablo, don't at me. Sure, why not, let's go with that. Actually, that looks much better. We're going with this. Alright. Uh, I'm not playing hardcore. There's a really, really cool thing, where if you play hardcore and you're one of the, like, um... One of the first to make it to, uh, level 100, your name will be physically inscribed on a statue of Lilith. That is badass. But no shot am I doing that. So this is my dude. It's time. Less guidance. I'm not a new Diablo player. I'm a seasoned veteran. And obviously... Tier 2. Tier 2, why would I play anything else? Someone, I think someone did the math. And, uh, like, going, um, going tier 1 is actually better. Like, in terms of time. Who cares, though? We're, go we're going tier 2. It's asking me for Tray was never meant for humankind. Whatever. It was forged as a refuge from the war between the high heavens and the burning hells. Instead, it became a new battleground in this eternal conflict. So this is the intro cinematic we've seen a bunch of times already. Called the Haradrim has kept mortals safe. But now this once powerful order is a husk of what it was. And centuries ancient creators have returned to claim the hearts of humankind. This is the story of their downfall. Spooky. 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 The obligatory crow. Pro-life tip. If you find weird statues in a forest, run. <laughs> like, you don't, you don't just wander around. 
some random location and find some wacky statues around. You just run at that point. And if you lose your horse while you're finding these statues, you run even faster. Like, don't even think about it. Just start running and do not stop until you're gone. Oh no! And last thing, if you hear whispers in a forest, oh boy, then you don't run, then you sprint. As fast as you can, in a random direction, never look back. Just some pro, pro life tips from, from your boy. I'm sure it'll be fine. So, I'm getting a bunch of rewards because I played the beta, I think. Let's see what we can say. Yikes. So basically, the, the idea right now... ...is simple. I don't remember the mines. That's the map. That's the map. Okay, I'll just go through here. How, how was the skill skill tree opened? I don't remember. But the idea right now is to become a whirlwind whirlwinding god. What's it to you? Just curious, really. Yeah, we'll go there. We'll we'll clean it up. It's no big deal. It's fine. Oh, uh, we don't want that. Could you protect us from whatever is out there? Not sure it'll be no problem. Else to turn. I you know, I'm a seasoned veteran after all. I will cleanse the old ruins of evil. Truly? Oh, thank you. There it is. An absolute giga chad. Demons? Yeah, I'll cleanse it. It's no big deal. All right, level 2. One skill point. How do I open the thing? Tell me. Uh, what am I supposed to... Oh, there it is. So, um... Where's a whirlwind? Whirlwind. Which one do I want to do? When will I be able to refund them? That's the question. I'll do lunging strike for now. I just want to get to Whirlwind. That's all I want. And then we'll be a Whirlwinding God. Uh, how does one basic attack now? Okay, sure. We'll just do a lunging strike over and over, it's fine. That's an upgrade. There we go. Simple enough. And let us descend down to the first dungeon.
So this is where, when I was playing the beta, I said that nothing would go wrong and the servers crashed and deleted my character for a second. Hopefully that doesn't happen this time. It is like 8 a.m., right? So British time, this is 6 a.m. We should be good. I don't think there's a lot of people online. I think everybody who stayed up to play late have probably now all gone to bed. So I think we really shouldn't have any server troubles right now at all. Just loot? No loot. Level up. Nice. Uh, let's do enhanced. And now we have this. We now have the core skills unlocked. All right. So Whirlwind is just around the corner. As soon as I get Whirlwind, that's when this game is just done. That's it. We've beaten the game at that point. There we go. Don't even need that. I do need loot though. There we go. Oh. No, this isn't quite the boss ri uh, boss yet. There we go. Zero troubles whatsoever. Might as well have started a hardcore character because I'm just not gonna die, ever. Not once. I certainly didn't die during the beta. Not even once. Let's kill the shaman. There we go. And that's it. Kill the shaman. There we go. I do find it very, very odd that they ultimately never put in, um, AW SD for controls. Like, that's how Diablo always was, but it seems like a very easy W. Just like, why not put it? Why not put it in the game? You can just turn it off if you don't, if you don't like it. Because I think playing Diablo decreases your mouse's lifespan by at least a couple of years. Oh, all right. Whirlwind. That's it. There it is. We've just beaten the game. Okay, maybe not just yet. I think my fury generation is non-existent at this point. So maybe not yet. Loot? Just money. Oh, what's here? Nothing. Great. Oh, is this the... Yes, this is the boss room. Dodge out of that. Alright, let's kill these guys. Don't even need to heal, not even once. Okay, maybe once. Dodge that. Okay, I'll heal one more time. Then no more. Maybe one more time. Is he immune? No, he's not. There we go. Simple that. Simple as that. Zero troubles whatsoever. That's an upgrade, that's an upgrade. Nice. Oh, what's that? 
Uh... I guess that works. I think there was something else down there. I don't know if I was supposed to click it, but whatever the case, I'm back. Yes. It was easy, really. Ruins are clear. Your town should be safe now. Truly. Ha! By the light, you are heaven sent. Oh, I'm so sorry. We, we haven't any coin to offer. But we have hot stew, good company, and... Stay for a pint. Wash out the taste of the stew. <laughs> <laughs> We'd be honored if you join us. Sure, why not? Oh, this is... Oh, my God. <laughs> I remember watching this scene in the beta. It looks so awkward. I don't know why. I just look so out of place. It's like, yeah, parties, right? That's what we do. And now I'm going to pass out. Same. This is why you don't trust random randos. And you don't go to fight the depths of hell. Trying to help them. Maybe. They are part of the depths of hell, you know. I saw my corpse, and from my mouth crawled hatred. A father burned his children on a pyre, and a mother molded a new age from the ashes. That's a yikes. Well, I mean, at least they have a dog. Uh, I saw the weak made strong, a pack of lambs feasting on wolves. Tears of blood rained on a desert jewel, and the way to hell was torn asunder. Sounds spooky. Then came a spear of light, piercing hatred's heart, and he who was bound in chains was set free. Oh, we know who that is. We know who that is. A certain man by the name of Marius. Kinda screwed everything up. A few times, really. Very relaxing. By mother's blood, by mother's body, so shall you witness her glory. There she is. For you die. Bonk. They're coming. The whole damned village. Get up. Get up. We have to fight our way out. There. Take them. Give the light All right. Surface. We're back in it. Let's pop off. Whirlwind. There it is. Stannis, probably not Baratheon. And that's them.
You're the madman from the shred. Those heretics drugged me after I returned from the ruins. Just like you. I came to my wits and escaped. Tried to get inside the chapel, but it was locked and... Yikes. What manner of evil is this? Uh, it's, ju it's just some flower petals. It's no big deal. Don't worry about it. I'm sure it's fine. They, they must have fed them to me. A blasphemous ritual. How did they learn this? Perhaps the answer lies in the chapel. They kept it locked up for a reason. The key might be on that woman who was leading them. Oh, apparently there are drops live as well. But that only happens Ju uh, June 6th, okay. The drops are not yet active, okay. I just wanted to make sure that maybe I don't have them turned on. But there are no drops just yet. Chapel key. Wonderful. Let's pop off. Right. So our only course of action right now, I should probably actually max out this, right? Because this is just like combat, grand berserking. I definitely want berserking. What's this? Yeah, I don't think I need, or maybe I do. Bleeding or berserking? I think berserking is probably a better, better idea, right? I would assume so. Because especially with like whirlwind, or we'll go berserking. So we'll do that, and then we just go all in on Whirlwind. Yes, that's the plan. Fire can cleanse the darkness in this place. Like the ones I was fed. Is this real? It's just some flower petals. I'm sure it's no big deal. I'm sure this won't end uh, end badly. Shameful. Our father has granted you a path to salvation. <laughs> and yet you stray from it at every opportunity. You drink, you gamble, you covet and steal. Shameful. A few beautiful flower petals. How calming. Sin is their birthright. Like I'm very biased towards all the er er uh, very early Diablo cinematics. Like even even Diablo one, I love those cinematics because of how simple they are. But I'm not gonna lie, this one really is really 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 good. It was obviously in the beta, so I I know what uh, know what it is, but still. The faith has taught you to deny your heart's desire and turned you into a prisoner within yourself. Break the chains and discover who you were meant to be. Break the chains and be beautiful in sin. Resist! Resist her temptation! <laughs> Gets me every time. Child 
into this world. I'm sorry, my dude. I <laughs> think think you're a bit uh, behind the curve, you know. I think they have other plans, unfortunately. I don't know what the in-universe explanation for her heterochromia is, right? Because one of her eyes is blue, the other is just gray. I wonder if there's a there's an actual reason for that. I'm not a lore aficionado in that sense. How did I get out of here? Collapsed inside. I thought that darkness had swallowed you. I dragged you here and put this cursed place to the torch. What happened to you in there? I saw a vision. A horned demon. She said the lords of hell are coming. She wanted to help the people survive. Help them? She called them her children. And they welcomed her like... Mother. Mother. Another life pro tip. It cannot be. If a demon tells you the lords of hell are coming, don't listen to them. <laughs> Roydy, then. Let us venture off. Alright, so I'm about to level up. Then I can get the... Oh, that's XP. Um... Oh, okay, so these are things we want to collect all over, right? Because they're literally permanent boosts. Okay. Okay. Uh... Should I do this? We'll do this later. I don't need to do this now. Right now, we'll just focus on the campaign. I think today, mostly what I want to do is, yeah, just focus on the on the campaign. Get as far as we can. And then if I need to level up for the capstone dungeon, then we can start thinking about uh, actually doing all the bonus stuff, right? I think that's the best course of action. For, for the first day, at least. Because eventually, I mean, I'll be doing all of them, right? And there's a level up. Alright, so... Let me... I'll take the combat one. I, I can refund them eventually. And what's this weapon expertise? Uh, so this is something I just gained passively, right? So this is not something I actually change. Okay, good. Uh, all right, how the hell do I get there? Oh, I need to go the other way. Never mind. Uh, all right, and this is seven skill points. That's like probably... Oh, it's all seven. Okay. Uh, all right. Now that we have Whirlwind, and now that we have Berserking, we're unstoppable. There we go. Nothing can stop me, and it will only get better from now. I, I'm gonna max out Fury, or not Fury. I'm gonna max out Whirlwind, and we'll just beat the game by spinning. It's just literally the spin to win build. I don't know how important gold will be. Because when I was watching the, um, the Force Gaming video, like he had like 2 million. Right? So, inflation has hit Sanctuary very hard, by the looks of it. So I don't know if I should be really worried about gathering money, or not. I'm gonna gather stuff, because I think it's going to be important for upgrading the consumables. 
But in terms of, like, saving up money, I don't think this is going to be, like, a... Straight up prepping for a raid and stuff, you know, where I need to save up a bunch of cash to, to attempt the capstone dungeon. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Freshly Why did it go for, like, 3 FPS for a second? Oh, I think it was some sort of transition into a cutscene. That makes sense. That's what you call a subversion. I'm bloody hungry. <laughs> I like how, like a few hours ago, I, I almost got drugged and killed uh, by literally one of the prime evils or whatever Lilith is supposed to be. I think she's higher than the prime. I don't know. I don't know what the hierarchy is, is like, but basically, yeah. Lilith is a Giga Chad. And now a few hours later, I'm like, yeah, you know what? I'm sure this dude is fine. Sanctuary. She was banished ages ago. But this world is her creation. It was prophesied she would come back. Lorath is the dude who delivered the uh, the cinematic exposition as well, right? I think so. Sanctuary has always been trapped amid the eternal conflict. A war between angels and demons. But Lilith serves neither side she has her own plans for us and me am i corrupted not sure yet but you two share a connection what will you do about it um go down to the depths of hell and win Find by spinning good then we're in this together rest while you can then we'll start in kiovashad if we can't stop Lilith, we'll all be damned. We'll be fine. I'll just spin my way through every single dungeon in the game. It'll be no big deal. Lilith's evil is spreading. I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. It's not like in Diablo every single time you, you sort of defeat the big bad. The story is like, peace lasted for now. And then it like the next Diablo game starts. You know, I'm sure we'll be fine. You know what? Like 10 years passed between Diablo 3 and 4. So at least we'll have like 10 more years of peace. That's how that works, right? Uh, what is the statue? The angel in Arius. I'm sure you've heard the Cathedral of Light babbling about their holy father. Well, he's real. An angel walks among us. And when he learns that Lilith is here, blood will flow. So, wait, so in lore, I think he was like, he was cast out of Sanctuary, right? And he became man. I think that's the lore. Or was that Tyrael? I watched the lore videos, but I've already forgotten. I think the lore is that, yeah, he was cast out of Sanctuary and then he just became a, became a man to pursue his mission. Alright. Let us go into the town. Let's see how many people are here. To enter Kiyobushad, you must perform a cleansing ritual. Meaningless gesture that some people take comfort in. How dare you! 
Just let him through, lad. I've tried for years to get Lorath to do the ritual. Fine. But this one stays. I'll do it, it's fine. I'll do your whatever bibble babble you want. Take a piece of holy cedar wood from the shrine and inscribe it with the sin which troubles you. Uh-huh. Then cast it into the bridge. Um, I'm gonna inscribe Inscribe nothing but scribbles. <laughs> this is a waste of time. <laughs> Did you say something? Oh no no no, it's fine. Spooky. There we go. I'm cleansed. You must feel as though a great weight has Oh for sure. I feel so much better. I feel so much better. The cleansing really, really helped me. I can feel all of my pores have been cleansed. My skin is as pure as it can be. Everything is great. So, what did you write on a little piece of wood? Uh, a horse? Are you going somewhere? in search of that pale man from your vision. I must know what part he plays in all this. But first, I need you to retrieve something of mine while I finish my negotiations. A merchant in the center of the city has it. Just tell him I sent you. All right, so this is where I think we're going to get our mini tour, right? Of the town. I mostly remember all of it. Mostly. But I think like all the big upgrades, they required like a level, right? So yeah, player level 10. So that's only something we'll be able to do a tad later on. Hello. Ah, so the old man's finally decided to buy it back. Knowing him, he didn't mention coin, did he? <laughs> if he wants his weapon, you will need to pay. I I heard inflation's gonna gonna go up big time, so you know what? I'll buy it. Twenty buckaroos? Sure. Strange amulet. I'm sure a strange amulet in the world of Diablo is nothing big. I'll hold on to it, and I'm sure nothing bad will happen. Just like those little shiny crystals a few years back, you know? Uh, apologies. Just colorful crystals. He also gave me this amulet. What is it? The mark of the Haradrim. An ancient order of scholars and mages. Oh, never mind. This, this, I think this was actually a good, uh, good amulet. Never mind. These days we are few in number. There is another Haradrim, Donan. His breadth of knowledge of our demons is equal only to his hubris. Sounds like he could help us. Hmm. You should seek him out in Skosglan. But don't forget about the cathedral. They'll be expecting you, and they might prove to be useful allies too. You're not coming with me. I'm going to the dry step to find out who that pale man is. Join me when you can, just be careful. Your ties to Lilith, the visions you see. You are the key to finding her and stopping whatever she has planned. I'm sure it'll be I'm sure it'll be fine. Don't worry about me. Sometimes, our paths in life are set to collide. We just don't know it. Whether it is by accident or fate's hand, there is nothing we can do about it. The wanderer lost in the storm, fed the blood of Lilith, saved by a lone monk. They look badass. Different lives and incidents drawn together. By what? Destiny? Or some greater power pulling the strings? I did not know. But at the time, I thought I had the chance to protect humanity from the daughter of hatred. The Wanderer's connection to her gave me hope. <laughs> 
I mean, you you can't you can't argue that like Diablo 4 is right back to that super dark setting. I love it. I love it because I was not a Diablo 3 enjoyer. I've said this many times. Diablo 1 and 2 goaded. Diablo 3 kind of mid. Diablo 3 was way too happy. Um, find your purchases. Incredible. I think I only get my mount around like level 40. Um, enhanced whirlwind. Uh, alright, so... That's an upgrade. Alright, so where's the main quest? Main quest? Let me activate this. There we go. Whoops. Uh There it is. Alright, so I just head up to the cathedral, alright. Exploring Sanctuary, yes. Sure. Awesome. We'll figure it out. What the hell is this? Oh, never mind, it's nothing. We were born in sin. Children of darkness. But the Father's light can be sought through penitence and faith. Walk in the light. Look at the shadow. The shadow is really cool. We must be ever Visually, the game is also like really good. Yes, Reverend Mother. Like the light of an I do think like in a weird way, some of the spells especially, I do think the Diablo 2 spells kind of look better than Diablo 4 ones, which is kind of odd. Uh, obviously, I mean Diablo 2 Resurrected, not like the, the vanilla one, but... For only light must remain. Cast out thine darkness, for only light must remain. Is this the one from the vest? Yes, Reverend Mother. Did Lorath not accompany? He sent me on without him. Putting faith in that old man was a mistake. What could possibly be of greater import? Some pale dude. Lilith. And Lilith, yeah. So, you know. Hmm. We have received word from one of our knights of a demon sighting in Gale Valley. The description matches too closely to the sighting in the vest. If you would travel to Yelesna and take stock of the events there, you would have the gratitude of the Cathedral of Light. I had thought to send Lorath, but... Again, he fails in his duty. With or without Lorath, the will of Inarius shall be done. Right, let's go pop over there, see what's up. We'll be fine. Take the knight's report, whoops. All right, sure, why not? I don't know if there's like going to be a huge, huge XP bottleneck or whether I can just focus on the main campaign and it'll be fine. I'm not sure. I guess right now this is level 7, right? And Act 2 is quest uh, level 10. So it's not too bad. Where is that? Oh. Take the spirit of the restless dead and grant them peace in return. I don't know what that is. I'm sure I'll figure it out sometime later. Uh, let's kill the archer, and now we spin to win. Spin to win again. There we go. And we've won. Slay the channeler to disrupt the rites. This is a bonus event. Okay. And then this is an elite. Spin to win. He's immune for some reason. Oh, I need to kill these guys. 
Now we spin to win. There's another dude keeping him immu uh, immune somewhere. Where is he? There it is. Let's heal. Spin to win. We're spinning to winning. Keep spinning. And simple as that. Keep spinning. Heal. Dodge. And then keep spinning. And then heal again. And then keep spinning. I don't have fury. Then we keep spinning. Simple as that. And that's a level up. And loot. That has to be an upgrade, right? Yes, it is. Great. Another world event. Where is it? Oh no, it's a challenge. Never mind. Uh, all right, let me let me spend the skill point as well. So where do I put this? Uh, where is it? Thirty percent damage while using a slash weapon. Whirlwind also inflicts forty percent of its base damage. Or should I just spec into base? Because maybe generating extra fury? How much does it cost to refund them? What if I click this button? Oh. Oh, so it's free. Alright, I'll just spec into this for now. Violent Whirlwind, why not? Why is the circle still there? Is it up again? Can I do it again? Sure, why not? I'll do it again. There we go. Is that it? Spin to win. Keep spinning to to win. Can I loot it again? No shot. Oh my god, I can. What was that? That's a helmet. What's this? That's an upgrade. Uh, what, what, what was the thing I just picked up? Obols. Curiosity vendor. Uh, vendor. Okay. Why not? All right, that's it. Back on, back on the main quest, and I gained almost another level. I don't think leveling is going to be an issue. Uh, how do I get there? Also, how do these weapons work? Hold on. So this is two-handed slashing, two-handed bludgeoning. Can I swap weapon? How do I swap weapon? Auto select. Uh, can I not do auto select? Uh, arsenal collection. Hold on. I think there's a way to change the weapon you would use. Psycho weapon. Oh. So I can do slicing. Okay. Let's try that. Ultra of Lilith. Let's get this. There we go. Uh, and then I need to go around here. There we go. Spin to win. There we go. Is that another upgrade? I think it might be. No, it's not. 
So wait, which one of these does more damage? Oh, uh, this is 94 DPS. Oh, never mind. So it's not even better. What? 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 Why is it not changing? Do I need to have this open? Oh, yes, I do. Bludgeoning. Bludgeoning. Okay. I think I figured it out. All right. Uh, also, there's another pathway here. The jump. Might as well heal. A spin to win. That's another level up. All right, so what are we doing now? Uh... Endless Fury, right? I think so, because I just want to keep spinning. So if I can generate more Fury while spinning, that means I can spin for longer. That's good. Oh, heavy boots. That is not an upgrade. Okay, there we go. Now I'm actively generating fury while I'm spinning. Which equates to more time spinning. I think we'll be good. What is this? Okay, so you can just use stuff for free. Great. I love the music. The ambience is really good. It's not like mega dark yet, but I assume as we get like deeper into all the dungeons and everything, it'll be it'll become much more dark. Uh, like right now, it's kind of hopeless. It's not really spooky, you know. I want it to be a bit spooky. These more strangers in the camp. Don't mind me, I'm just doing my thing. Alright, and this is where we're going to go into the uh actual Lilith dungeon. Are you Vigo? I was sent. Oh, why is my FPS limited for cutscenes? I thought the cutscenes looked a bit wacky. Whatever. She had horns like a beast. The stream is maxed out at 30 anyway, so it doesn't matter on stream, it's just for me. My mother's trapped in there with her. You let my mother through, sir. Shouldn't you be responsible for her safety? We have soldiers stationed inside. You should be worried about them too. Maybe you can help me. Uh, revered mother, uh, mother Prava sent me. The horned woman is the demon Lilith. No, that can't be. My mother taught me that name. You speak of the daughter of hatred. Daughter of hatred, yeah, that rings a bell. Pretty sure that's her. I'm sure it's fine though. So I think this is the last major piece of story we got in the um. In the beta. This dungeon here. Or at least is the last bit I did. Because all I needed to do was hit like level 20, right? Or level 25 maybe was it. I don't even remember. Whatever it was. It's basically here that we stopped. We got all the Lilith stuff. And then we fought the big boss. And that's it. Of course we do. Look out. 
spin. There we go. It's mine now, girl. She gave it to me when I let her and her friend pass through. Sure she did. Alright. Keep close. Quest complete. Nice. That's another upgrade. Maybe we should go back. Round up the knights. I do look a bit wacky though. Like look at me. Ooh. Nope. Alright, let's focus this guy. And then we're gonna spin. We're gonna keep spinning. We're gonna keep spinning. We're just gonna keep spinning. There we go. As soon as I can, I'm just going to keep spinning. Keep spinning. There we go. Right. I don't remember what this thing is. I think it's supposed to be like a protective barrier. But I'm not entirely sure. It's probably not helped by the fact that there's some very spooky stuff going underneath, you know. Just just some some mild stuff like Lilith being summoned and whatnot. It might actually be worth like rebinding some of the stuff to my mouse. Because, like, pressing A for skills is fine, but pressing Q for heals, I don't know, that seems a bit odd. Even though Q for heals is, like, a thing in a lot of games. Even Far Cry was Q, right? I don't know, with Diablo, it feels different. This is certainly not an arena right now. Uh, when I click this door, mobs will not spawn. Over here. I can squeeze through to the other side. Wait, hold on. And there she goes. Of course. Enemies approaching. Nowhere to go. Give me more enemies so I can start spinning. That's probably an upgrade. Let's see. Yes, it is. Also an upgrade. Noise. Uh, might as well heal, why not? Oh, and I'm literally like 2 XP away. Okay, actually 250, but... Same thing. Get through all these, and that's a level up. Okay. What am I? What am I doing now? Ten percent additional fury. Actually, maybe I should have started picking uh, shouts. Now that I think about it. Um. And actually, ten percent chance to make vulnerable also sounds pretty good. I 
I'm sure I'm sure we'll figure it out. If not, I'll just look up a guide later and it'll be good. We'll be good. I remember like way back in Diablo 2, I made like a wacky fury build. Uh, it's not fury, it's frenzy, right? And um, it was such a slog to get through the game. And after I actually looked up how, like how you would build a proper character, because in Diablo 2, like originally you obviously couldn't respec at all, right? You could only respec once. But you know, there's a bunch of ways of respecing if you really want to. Because I, I usually just played offline, I didn't play online, I didn't really care about trading and, all, and all, all that. So when I looked up how you actually build a character, like the game literally became like five times easier. It's kind of ridiculous. So that's why right now I'm sort of like, sure. As long as I can spin, I'm sure I'll be fine, but later on, I'm probably just going to look up a guide. Just to make sure that I'm not really kind of holding holding myself back actively. For the first playthrough, though, I'm just gonna go blind. Alright. Are these an upgrade? No, they're not. Heal. I'm not dying here. Two handed hammer. I mean, it's a white. Not gonna be an upgrade, right? Yes. I need to remember to sell all that stuff. Remember to spend your skill points. Yes, yes, yes. How could I forget? What are we looking at? That statue. It's oh yeah, the statue is definitely her. The way I saw her. Lilith. We need to find my mother. Right then. Let's push on. Um, hello? That's not my internet. That's the server. My internet's perfectly fine. Over there, the hoist. At last, I'll ride out. Nope. Or maybe? Well, you can go get them. I'll go. I'll go solo. What was that? It came from beyond the gate. Okay, so no, he's actually sticking with us. Okay, never mind. I remember. I remember this guy leaving somewhere along the way. We can see that, yes. The other woman, Venard. Where is she? She begged for her life. Well, I spared her. 
Let her deeper in. <laughs> Give up, girl. <laughs> She's lost. You, you must listen. Steve did nothing. <laughs> oh, 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 spells. Prayers. All useless. Go to Corvan. Tell Prov. Raise the army. The father. Evil. Itself. Mox sanctuary. Do this for me. He is dead. I'm done for. Yeah, I think this is where he leaves us, and then we go on. Go on with uh, with just the two of us. I'm I'm sure we'll be fine. We'll figure it out. It's like, it's no big deal. We'll go in there. He said steel does nothing. Hold on. Momo is chewing on my jacket. That's not good. Hold on. Momo? Could you not do that, please? Not anymore. Bravo. We just, uh... know what to do. You're leaving us? Abandoning her? There's nothing left to abandon. She's good as dead. I'm sorry. There we go. How's that fixed? Really All right. <sighs> it's up to us now. Uh, all right. Lilith showed me the ugly truth of our cosmos, the eternal conflict. Angels and demons have battled over control of all of creation for all time. To what end, I asked, as she simply laughed. I love that nihilism in Diablo. What is this? How your mind races. Yes, I am Lilith. Hello. Mother I'm Crodo. Daughter of hate. I have what you see. You dragged your child all over Sanctuary in pursuit of it. No, I... I taught her how to survive. Is that what you want to believe? Drop the act. You have questions. <coughs> I have answers. I know the fabric of the cosmos. Everything I've read has warned me against you. You've read so you remember all those tips I gave when we started the game? Like, you see spooky stuff, you run. You hear spooky stuff, you run even faster. I... I don't know. She didn't listen. <laughs> She's like, oh yeah, everything I've read about you has sort of said that no one should really do anything with you. And here she is. She's like, no, you know what? Actually, she came this way with Lilith. How can you be sure? Uh, sometimes I see visions of the past. I saw them. What? How? Lilith's petals. Her blood was fed to me once. Hmm. Right, the Royce then. Let's kill the shaman. And then we spin. There we go. That's a dead end. Oh, where's the shaman? Is there a shaman? I don't think there is one. There we go. I think this is... Or no? Oh. Got a little close to death there. That we do not like. Alright, so far so good. I guess let's climb down. 
Usually with these things you gotta cl you gotta climb further and further down, right? Yep, there it is. And that's level 10. Should I should I get a shout? I don't care about taunting enemies, like who cares? Actually damage reduction for six seconds. Um I'll do rallying cry. I guess. Yeah, sure. More petals. So curious. You are eager to know. Also, I can upgrade my potions now. Because I'm level 10. Yes. Do you have faith in me? I want to. Good. For now. All you need know is that we are going to meet my son. Rathma. The first necromancer. He is that, and more. He is the key to my plans. It sounds like they're searching for Lilith's son, Rathma, together. Mother, what are you thinking? I'm sure she has her reasons, and I'm sure we won't be fighting her in, uh, in just a minute. Also, I'm almost trying to get into trouble again. You might hear him occasionally in the background. There's a little corner in my room, right, that is barricaded up because it has a bunch of cables underneath. And I don't want him to, to get to the cables. And he's trying to dig through the barricades. It's impossible. He's been trying it for literal years now. But he's still attempting it. It's kind of amusing, really. At least he's having fun. Uh, alright. Let's kill the shaman. And keep spinning. Keep spinning. Do not stop spinning. There we go. Might as well heal. Is this an upgrade? No, it's not. That is definitely an upgrade. And all this is... Mark all of this as junk. Oh no, that's an upgrade. I think I'll be able to sell all this, like, when I get to the town. There we go. Bunch of dudes here. That's a shaman. Um, something tells me I need to go here. Here and to the left. Was I right? I'm not sure. I know tile sets are definitely a thing in this game. People were even complaining about it, that you could literally just tell where you need to go. I don't know the tile sets, I'm gonna be honest, I'm just guessing right now. But this seems like the right way to go. Intuitively, it feels that way. Oh, that's probably an upgrade. Yes, it is. A 
Okay, maybe it wasn't the right way. I think I've gone in a big circle. It's definitely, it's definitely not back, right? It's definitely going to be here, right? I've said that it's not going to be here, so it definitely will be. Whoops. Uh, no, we've gone in a big circle. I was wrong. We had to go to the right. Also, are there like returnal thingies in Diablo 4? I think there were. I just don't remember what the button for it was. I'll figure it out later. That was my favorite part in Diablo 2, that you could cheese bosses by constantly just spawning uh, spawning portals. It felt like a very RPG thing to do. It obviously wasn't optimal gameplay, that you just keep teleporting back and forth, but I don't know, it's one of those classic RPG things that I actually enjoy, even though it's dumb. Let's get the Shaman. Get the range dude. There we go. Huh. Again. Does Lilith know we're coming? Probably. That's an elite. Look at this DPS. Zero issues. You've mastered your fear. I still sense your pain. My magpie. She's scared right now. She must be. Go. Or stay. It is time to choose. Unfortunately, we know what she chose. I trained her well. She's a good kid. Strong. She'll be all right, she is. You've chosen well, my child. To reach Rathma, we will need to cross a lake at the bottom of these ruins. It requires a ritual. I will teach you. A ritual, you say? I'm sure it won't involve draining my blood? Or draining some other blood? Good. Or blood in any way? You're ready for lesson one. Oh. <laughs> that is the key. I'm, I'm gonna be honest, I didn't remember the dialogue. What I made that up. But yes, apparently my blood is key. Tell me. Lilith plans to teach your mother a ritual. One that needs blood. Your mother seemed uh, receptive. It is what it is. All right, let's keep going. I think this is the last big stage. And then we're right into the boss fight. Oh, let's get, let's get all the ranged ones for, ooh, shiny. Let me check the shiny. There, you, there it is, look at me. Now I look at least 5% more badass. So far, the shiny drop rates seem okay. Like, they're not too bad. Because I remember when I was playing the beta, they were increased, right? But I, I was always a fan of rare items, like, genuinely being rare. Because when I started playing Diablo 3, 
which again I did not like. It felt like legendaries were dropping left, right, and center. I mean, at that point, it's like, why do you even call it a legendary? Just call it like, I don't know, epic, you know? Because legendary implies that it is an item of legend. Items of legend do not drop every three uh, three months. Keep spinning. Just keep spinning. Eventually they'll die. There we go. Simple as that. Alright. That's an upgrade. That's also an upgrade. So this might actually do more damage now. Yes. So let me swap. Let me swap my whirlwind. Oh, auto select is just going to always pick the, the mo more powerful one, I suppose. Okay. That's cool. So we'll do that. For now, at least. Maybe later when I get, like, weapons with specific effects, then it'll make sense to, uh, to switch. I assume that's how it works. And I just went into big circle again. Great. And now we keep spinning. Keep spinning. There we go. I think I need to get rid of some of the whites I have. Because these are like... I mean, cell value 4. Cell value 5. Like, even if they're not really upgrades, might as well just sell them for more. They're just having an inventory full of whites. Uh. There we go. I wonder whether I'll need to go back to town to upgrade my stuff before I take on the boss. Because right now I don't feel like I'm really struggling at all. This might age poorly, but right now I think we're doing actually really good. This way, right? No, it's not. So that end. All right. Let me pick. So what's this? War cry. Hold on. So what's? God damn it. Oh, war cry is really important. I c I think I need war cry, like right now. But I kind of want to pick pain points as well, just to do, like, increased damage. Or pressure points, rather. I'll do that. We're gonna spec full damage. We're gonna kill kill things before before I even need anything for regen. I mean, look at this, we're one-shotting mobs. There it is. Is this the final gate? So I literally just need to fight for 30 seconds. Can I spin for 30 seconds straight? Probably not yet. Probably not yet. Soon, though. Alright. Spin. 
spin again. There we go. Simple enough. Alright, I think this is actually the last level. Is there anything here? Nope. Quest complete. Do I get something? No, I don't. Oh, let me just toss out some, some whites. The ones that have like zero save, sale value, basically. It's 12, 6. Yeah, the rest are at least worth something. Alright. It's a very weird thing to say. There she is. Yep. So I remember doing this. I don't remember doing much after this. So I think this might actually be it. Mother? Mirel? You're just in time. Beyond this lake lies the necropolis of the firstborn. A trove of magic and knowledge. I opened the way for Lilith, but I could not pass through with her. I... I lack divine element, you see. Stop. But I can find it. I'm so close. I simply need... Mother, stop. Look at what Lilith has done to you. You're writing in your own blood. My little... It's totally normal. She awakened me. She showed me things... I can't even put into words. Once I've finished, you will understand. I don't care what she showed you. Please, let's just get out of here. <laughs> oh, I see. Yes, clever magpie. Trying to lead me away so you can take all this for yourself. Hmm? Yikes. I will finish these rooms with your blood. Oh. You must stop All right, she had like ads. There we go, it's one. I should probably start dodging those things, because they actually do quite a bit of damage. Yeah, let's dodge those. Uh, let's get out of that. Alright, now we spin. This is why playing ranged in games is almost always better. Because I literally need to... Like, walk right into them. To do anything, which means... Most likely walking over mechanics. I'm sure we'll be fine, though. We'll just keep spinning. And eventually we'll get it. There we go. Now we spin. Momo. I want to see my screen. Oh my god, I can't see my health. Okay, we're good. Oh, uh, I'm stunned. Spin. Keep spinning. 
pop the buff. Dodge out of that, or don't. Start spinning. Keep spinning. Keep spinning. Do not stop spinning. Get stunned. Heal. And start spinning again. Okay, maybe not. Pop the buff. Heal. And then spin. Okay, I, kinda, I think I need to get this for safety. Okay, that's another one down. Last one. Could you please move out of the thing where I actually can hit you? That'd be great. There we go. Didn't even break a sweat. I don't think she was. I don't want to hate you. I'm trying. I really am. We're going to make Lilith pay for what she's done. So we need blessed blood. Go back to your brother. Get that blessing. Beg if you need to. Whatever it takes. My mother started this damn ritual. I'm going to finish it. Oh yeah, right. No, no, no. There's another. There's another quest line here that we still did in the beta. Because this isn't the act, boss. Finding it was her life's work. So much for that. Maybe it will help with the ritual. If not, at least I can bury her where she won't. I need. I'm sorry. Just leave me. All right, she done. And I got mother's knife, which is not usable by my class. Excellent. Um, I should be able to recall somehow, right? There it is. That's how you do it. All right, let me go upgrade my potions. And actually, do I have any class stuff I need to do? Uh, priority quests. So yeah, this is just like general stuff. So I didn't mean to click that. I didn't mean to click that. Okay, let's teleport back. Let's teleport back. Sanctuary. Please don't tell me there's a cooldown on it. There's not. Okay, good. Good. Let me go upgrade my potions. And then we'll see what we can see. Uh, potions is down here, right? This is the potions hut. Hello. Well, you certainly have the look of someone who spends a lot of time in the wild. I hope some yeah, great. materials we can use this time. I'll yeah, yeah, sure. Sure. Um, tiny healing potion. Minor healing potion, that's level 20. Craft elixirs. Um increase experience. Uh, sure, why not? The rest I don't really care about right now. Alright, what else is there? Priority quests. Uh, item upgrading. I think I know about this. Let's have a look at you, hmm? You live or die by the quality of your equipment. If you have the coin and materials. Sure. Uh, Alright, so let's see. I can't get. Wait, what? 
salvage, repair, upgrade. So what if I want to upgrade this? I need rawhide, which I do not have. All right. This, this I can upgrade. Um, this I cannot. This I also cannot. All right. So let me salvage. There we go. Oh, that's an upgrade. Hold on. So, should I sell stuff or should I salvage stuff? Let me do like half and half. I'll salvage that and I'll sell the rest. Um, how does one sell stuff? Can I like sell all? Oh, that's upgrading. Uh, how does one... Salvage by quality, repair... How do I sell stuff to you? I Maybe I can, maybe I need to talk to a merchant. I think I do. So... There it is. Okay. Okay. I think we're good. And now that I actually did that, hold on, maybe I can actually upgrade something. Upgrade this. There it is. Cool. And that is no use to me. So that I can upgrade, alright. I don't really care about the rest because all the all the rest is like uh it's like blues, right? And I'm gonna replace them very fast. Alrighty then. Alrighty then. So far so good. So I guess we can go back to the main quest. Let's do this. I think I did all the priority ones, yes. See that the kitchen is ready for the morrow service. Angels above. You've returned. Yeah, as I said, it was no big deal. Fought some demons. Solid lith a bunch. It's fine. Seek your blessing there. Everything is unfolding as Inarius foretold. Soon, he will be free to escape sanctuary and return to the heavens where he belongs. Right. Uh, so where's that? Coal, 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 coal? That's, that's far away. Well, okay then. Should I do this? This is three quests, this is five quests. And this is on the way. We'll do this first. We'll do this first, then we'll do the other one. Because both of them are Act 1, and I think I need to do, like, literally all the quests anyway. So we'll finish this, then we'll move on to Act 2. I guess. It's odd that it shows me the, the, um... Yeah, because, like, in Diablo 2, like, the Acts were linear, right? So you couldn't just randomly go off to do Act 2, because technically I think I can run over and start doing Act 2. I just need to walk over there. Which is odd odd to me. I don't know how Diablo 3 works, but Diablo 1 and 2, you, I mean, you couldn't just start doing random stuff, really. We'll figure it out. There we go. I guess I actually want to kill some of the beasts on the way as well, because I want to get, like, the crafting items. There we go. Ooh. Let's gather these on the way as well. Oh, actually, let me let me use the buff. There we go. This boosts my XP gain, so I'll level faster, which is great. That is great. We like that. I do find it very odd that they ultimately never put in the overlay map. 
Because the argument was basically that, you know, it's like, it's very immersive. And I agree with that, because if you have an overlay map, you're literally just paying, paying attention to the overlay, right? It's like, you're barely paying attention to the actual game. But at the same time, I think constantly opening and closing the map is even less immersive. With Diablo, at least, it's not like immersion breaking because it's very fast, right? I can literally do this and that's it. But still, I find it odd that they never put it in. Like with all these things where they say like it's immersion breaking or whatnot, it's like just put it in as a toggleable option. If you don't like it, just turn it off, you know? It doesn't have to be like this... this all or nothing type of deal. Because, like, personally, I like paying attention to the actual visuals as well. So that's what I usually do. Like, even in Diablo 2, right? I pay attention to the map, map, I sometimes turn it off. It's not like I have it constantly on. And even if I do, I don't really look at it constantly. Is this an upgrade? No, it's not. Uh, Alright, so... No, this is this is this is out of out of range. What the hell are you? Uh, is that? No, that's just a random random NPC. Where the hell is this Nayrel? Here? No. And this is just the town again. Where the hell is this person? I mean, there's a dead dude. Alright, you know what? I think I actually know where it is. I think it's up there. That looks like a quest area. Look at this. Let's get these. It's definitely here. I mean, look at this. This is like quest area 100. Yep, there it is. Wait, hold on. What's that say? Behold. Okay, never mind. I remember doing this. I remember parts of this. Uh, let's, let's get rid of this one. So these are like tree dudes from The Witcher, basically. Is what it looks like. Uh, what's this? Heavy boots. Let's see if they are an upgrade. They're probably not. Yes, they're not. Let's spin. Keep spinning. Great. I'm about to level up as well. Actually gonna get the potion. And that's a level up. Let me clear these dudes, then we'll then we'll look what we want to spec into. There we go. That's another ring. Might as well heal. Um Cold resist and lightning resist. Lightning resist, fire resist. 
I'll just stick with that one. It's yellow, right? It must be better. All right, let me do abilities. Um, I definitely want to get to this, right? Spend the number indicated in this. Uh, I guess I'll do that. All right, keep spinning, keep spinning, keep spinning, keep spinning, keep spinning. Keep spinning, keep spinning, and that's all of them. Just that simple. Ah, uh, it's not an upgrade. That is an upgrade, though. All right. So we are going there. How are we going to get there? I think I need to take the little path. Like right there. There we go. Let's go take this little path. Slide down. There we go. No, but this just took me back to where I was. Okay. So is it is it over here? Maybe? Well, let's, let's group up all these guys. Then we spin. go oh let's get the ranged guy first uh oh, let's group them up and now we spin we do want to get the vampire guy first because he's just going to keep healing Come on. Come on, finish him off. There we go. Alright, these have got to be upgrades. Both of them are, are blues. And I think I think I'm still using just whites. Let's see. That's an upgrade. That is not an upgrade. That's the same thing. Uh, pants. That's great. That's great. Uh, those are definitely not an upgrade, but fine. Uh, I guess that's cool. If only there was actually something to attack. So right now I'm literally just wasting it. Well, I mean, where the hell am I supposed to go? I guess down there? All right, let's try going there. I can't pass through that, okay. And then let's pass down here. Surely this must be it. Are you serious? Oh no, there it is. There it is. You're stuck in an illusion created by the Horadrim. The portal will lead you through this crude trap. I'm sure it's fine. A fiery portal, I'm sure it's I'm sure it's totally fine. Tristram. It's Tristram. 
Who are you? Who are you? An admirer of sorts. I saved you in the mountains. You'd lost your horse and crawled into that cave. Would have frozen to death if not for me. Why are you helping me? Oh, it's very simple. You want to stop Lilith, and I want you to succeed. But you'll never do that by following the Horadrim. I mean, the Horadrim are kind of goats, though. I mean, Deckard Cain, you know? Their path always ends in fire and death. Isn't that just like kind of all of Diablo, though? I feel like all of Diablo just eventually leads to blood and death. See. I have returned. Right. Let's get back into it. It's time to see what we see in the vision of Tristram. Oh, we're leaving the vision of Tristram. Why are you telling me all this? To hello, hello. A day will come when the Horadrim stumble. Don't be there when they do. The portal will lead you to that little girl you're looking for. Righty then. Fiery portals always lead to safe places. Back in the Haradrim's illusion. Oh, there she is. I think I've lost my way. The same thing happened to my mother and me earlier on. The trail to the vault ends here. We should be somewhere around in these woods. Okay, I guess let's wander around once again. Wait, so is this is this supposed to be like the last stage of the quest already? Or is it... No, it's still quest 2 of 3. Alright, so this is one big quest. I'm half asleep, but how is Diablo 4 so far? I mean, this is still, uh, still all stuff I played in the beta, right? So, most of this is already familiar to me. But I mean, I love it. I love that it's back to the darkness. I love the combat. I love that I can spin and win. You know, it's great. I'm more so curious about the end game. And to be fair, I'm also half asleep, so it's fine. I think this is this is not like the main main quest. I think the other one is the one that takes me to the actual act boss from what I remember. Or maybe not. Not what I expected. But I not give up hope. All we need is one book, one spell to help us cross the Black Lake and stop Lilith. I'm sure it'll be that easy. I'm sure it won't end with me lodging a soul stone into my head. And eventually becoming like Diablo or something all over again. I'm sure we'll just cross the lake. Stop Lilith and it'll be great. Right, what am I looking for again? Uh, search access for the main... Okay. I think I'm gonna go for, for the 15% increased rage generation. And then I think I might be able to spin indefinitely. And at that point, we've beaten the game. So you're gonna enter a dungeon, start spinning, and just spin all the way through. I see no, I see no faults in this plan. That's a shield. Imagine using a shield. What would you ever use a shield? That's a level up, and that that's a shiny. Unfortunately, it's another chest piece though. It is a big upgrade, though. Six to all stats. I mean, it looks freaking badass, though. God damn, look at that. This is like out of Game of Thrones. That's badass. All right, let's fill up on this. Oh, is the boss room. Okay. So this is what I actually remembered. Q. 
Keep spinning. Keep spinning. Keep spinning. I should have spent the skill point. I really should have spent the skill point. Destroy the orb. Uh, dodge that. Or don't. Start spinning. Keep spinning. Kill the orb. Then keep spinning. Okay. That's two health pots. Great. Now we spin. I'll grab one of them. Okay, I didn't get to dodge that either, I think. Maybe I did, I'm not sure. Alright. Ooh, ow. Okay. Let's get rid of the orb. Let's get rid of that orb as well. I can't even speak anymore. Dodge that. Excellent skill. This fight is a bit long. No, it's not. No, it's not. I, I'm doing just too much DPS that the boss has scaled up exponentially. It's not that I'm doing low damage, it's that I'm doing so much damage that the boss has just scaled up, okay? I promise. I'm sure I'll kill it eventually. Kill the orbs. Oh, uh, dodge that. Or don't. Then we just start spinning. Alright. Ooh! Okay, that was really bad. I'm sure it's fine, though. Keep spinning. Keep spinning. Don't stop spinning. Okay, just one, just one more, just one more cycle and we'll be good. One more cycle. Start spinning, and that's it. There it is. There it is. Got a big axe. That's actually an upgrade. There it is. Simple as that. I should take this back to Nerel. Uh, do I need to... Oh no, she's back there, alright. Uh, where does this take me? Please don't tell me this takes me back to the town. Okay. Okay. And let me spend the skill point. So what am I gonna... What am I gonna get? Increasing your damage dealt. You see? This is why it took that long. I wasn't expecting to Warcry yet. Now that I have Warcry, we're done. It's gonna be super easy from this point on. I'm gonna pop Warcry, then when I start spinning, everything's just gonna die. It's gonna be easy. Yes, I'm playing a Barbarian. The only class that's worth playing. Why would you play anything else if you have a Barbarian? There's literally not a single reason to play anything else. Aside from a Barbarian. It's like, does Barbarian exist? Yes, then play Barbarian. It's really as simple as that. Um, uh, Gonna mark all of this as junk. Because you can spin? Exactly. Exactly. As long as you can spin, the game is just like... It's just great, you know? You see enemies, you just keep spinning. And eventually they'll die. It might take a bit longer than like with, I don't know, with like Sorcerer. 
And you know, when you're fighting a boss, like, yeah, dodging mechanics is a bit more painful. But you're spinning, you know? Uh, all right. I don't think I can I can upgrade my potions or anything. I think that was level 20. So let me refill on health. And then we'll do the other main quest, which is all the way up there. So I need to go through here, I presume. All right. Let's go. Just spawn more mobs so I can start spinning. I mean, you're giving me like three mobs per second. Oh, there we go. Oh my god, you gave me another chest? Can I get more shinies that are not chest pieces? Oh, that actually hurts. Let's get rid of this guy. This guy is actually kind of dangerous. There we go. Oh, he didn't die. Now he's dead. Alright, let's go into this. Uh... Wait, hold on. Am I gonna run out of time? No shot. Did I do it? Or did I run out of time? I think it's good. Okay. I thought I could dodge out of that, but I guess not. There we go. Give me a shiny. Something that's... Okay, never mind. Alright, let's look at the shiny chest piece. It's not even an, up uh, an upgrade. Great. I love this game. Thank you very much. It gives me intelligence. Does it look like I need to be intelligent? I have a big axe. Intelligence is not particularly something I need to dabble in. Stunned. There we go. Nice. All right, and please tell me it's actually through to here. I think it is. I'm not ready yet. Hope this isn't some weird loop to loop thing. Ooh. There's a thingy up there. Let's go activate this. A waypoint. There we go. Uh, Alright, and then that leads me there. Okay. I must wait. I'm 99% sure that this is the last quest line I did in the beta. Because the rest are Act 2. And we only had Act 1. So the rest of this is completely new. After this, that is. You're, there. You're kind of sus, my guy. I don't know. I don't know. You seem to be, you know, kind of... Kind of wanting to use me. Not many could bear your sins. Kind of sus, man. Kind of sus. Just open the door. Come on. I'm, I'm kind of the chosen hero here. Just open the door. Just open the door. There we go. What is that? You've returned. What the hell is that? Vigo here tells me you were braver than the Gathering Legions. Oh my god, are we back in World of Warcraft? Okay. I need a divine blessing. You will be made worthy of a blessing. A holy war cannot be won with faithless troops. Make no mistake. This war is holy. Lilith has brought the eternal conflict to Sanctuary. And Inarius will deliver us as writ in prophecy. Until I'm sure you're right. We have our so just give me the blessing. 
And then I can go and spin through every dungeon in the game. Cleanse your spirit. Then we may discuss a blessing. May as well make myself useful. Come by the ruins, south of here. Okay. Ruins south of here. Uh Wait. No, it's fine. I'll just walk there. Okay, I can't. I can't do some. Wait, what? I mean, there are literally stairs there. Fine. Fine. I'll walk around. I'll walk around like a normal human, and I won't use the perfectly fine stairs that are clearly a shortcut down to where I'm supposed to be. Fine. I'll use the stairs. Alright, uh... That is an event. Some sort of an event. Hello. Uh, what must I do for the pilgrimage? I think I need to go through like some visions if I remember correctly, and then there's a bunch of stuff I need to gather for him. For some than others. Watch out, all right? I'll find you at the end. Alrighty then. First, I want to check out what this is. Talk to the Wanderer. What is this? What is this? Hello? Um, oh, there they are. So that's wave one. Didn't really seem like a wave, but okay. That is a wand that I cannot use. But it's shiny. Not ready yet. I guess I can like disenchant that or craft that or whatever you use with you you do with them. That's another level up. Um. Alright, I'll look at the map charm. Keep spinning. Keep spinning. Keep spinning. Keep spinning. Just keep spinning. Keep spinning. Do not stop spinning. Nice. There must be an achievement for like spinning for two minutes straight or something ridiculous. Nice. All right. What is this? A ring. Shadow resist. Poison resist. Lightning resist. Fire resist. Plus two maximum life. Eh. I sure. I. I guess I'll replace it with that. I guess. All right. Let me. Let me look at this. Um. If at least six enemies are nearby when you cast Warcry, your damage bonus is increased by an additional 10%. Warcry grants you 15% base life as Fortify. 
I'll do 20% increased rate generation just so I can keep spinning. Our only goal now is to maintain spin. As we know, it's the most powerful force in JoJo. And then when I can maintain spin, that's when um, that's when I'll start buffing my spin. And then I will have an immensely powerful infinite spin. That's the strat right now. We'll see how it plays out though. Because right now I don't think I have like barely any survivability. I'm sure it won't be a problem though. But that's the thing, right? If you kill if you kill things fast enough, you just don't need to survive because they just die first. That's the plan right now. All right. Let me walk up here. Uh, hello? Hark, creature of darkness, for you have wandered beyond the reach of Wonder what the max spin time is? I don't think there is one. I think if you can maintain your rage generation, um, or I guess it's fury or it's rage. It's fury, yeah, in this. So if you maintain, like, fury generation, a constant uptime, I think you can gener uh, genuinely just spin indefinitely. Obviously, you need to have mobs around, though. Because, like, even when I get stuck between mobs now, I can sort of spin indefinitely and my, my fury is uh, capped all the time. Keep spinning. Keep spinning. Keep spinning. Okay, now I'm out of spin. Let's, let's get rid of the archers. There we go. There we go. Has that done? Alright, let's grab the second one. Spinning is definitely a lot more a lot more powerful than frenzy. Because in the beta I did a frenzy build and that was kinda weak. Everything took too long. This though, this is badass. Uh, alright. There we go. Move out of that. All right, they're all dead. Great. Uh, is there another one, or this is, or is this it? I think there's another one. I think this is the last one. I'm pretty sure this is the last one. I seem to remember something like that. And then I think it's right up to the act boss and then that's it. That's where we're in fresh territory from then on out. There we go. I kind of just want to always have a huge axe at this point. Because the spinning animation with the big ass axe is so good. I just want a big axe. Because technically I think I can do whirlwind with basically any weapon. Including like one handers, but that would be so, so much less cool. Uh, Alright, let's grab all this. Uh, ooh. That's good. Um. Uh, 
Oh, I'm terrified. That's not good. Let's move out of that. Uh, let's heal, let's heal, let's heal, let's heal, let's heal. Let's not get terrified, and he's dead. Very nice. Very nice. Might as well have played hardcore. Might as well. We're never gonna die. Okay, I think this might actually be another one. Or are we done? No, we're not done. This is the last one. Oh no, this is just like, yeah, I just need to bring it back, it's fine. That was the last one. You are nothing without faith. Hold fast to the light and remember. Where the hell are these guys dropping from? <laughs> is there like a plane flying overhead that I'm not seeing? My guys just dropped from the freaking sky. Alright, there we go. It is what it is. Why isn't this working? <laughs> Is the little notch in his shield, like, meant to be where you put your spear? Because if it is, that's cool. It seems like it. You'd put it down and then the spear would go on top. That's badass. It's cool attention to detail. If that is what it is. I don't know, I have no idea. Alright, so this is where I think the act boss was. I think this is where we get the blessing and that's that's when we get to the uh to the final bit would you consider uh the beta short experience i mean i kind of rushed through it because i mean you know fobo it had like the um you had to get to level 25 or 20 i don't remember to get the thing so i kind of went through it fast but it still took me like i don't know like six hours probably something like that I wouldn't call it particularly short, but I wouldn't call it very long either. I think technically you could put in like at least 50 hours into it if you wanted. Just replaying characters. This is how you choose to approach me. Yes. Traverse the Black Lake, and that cannot be done without your blessing. If I've learned anything during my time here, it is that what we're looking for and what we need are rarely the same thing. I once thought I could find an end to this war, but there has been no resolution, only more pain. Everything I've done has pulled me further from home, from the place I need to be. This world we made was born from the impossible, and yet, like its creators, it rots from the inside. I... I don't... Lilith has entered the ancient city. With your blessing, I can pursue her. Listen here. I'm kind of the protagonist in this story. This audience is concluded. What an asshole. What an asshole. Back in my day, we worked alongside Tyrael, and everything was fine. He was much cooler than you. We took on Diablo, we took on Bale. It was great. 
Or the main character? Exactly. And this guy doesn't even want to talk to me. Like, come on, my guy. There's this little thing. Little, little, little thing called Lilith. You know, kind of, kind of breaking reality. You know? I'm really curious about the ending of Diablo 4, though. I wonder if we're, like, really back to the roots of Diablo, whether it's going to be, like, the same cyc uh, cyclical thing as with Diablo 1. Where it's just, like, us becoming Diablo again. That'd be cool. I always loved that part of, um, part of Diablo in terms of storytelling. It's like, it's like mega, mega cynical and, um, and, 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 uh, whatchamacallit, nihilistic in that sense. It's just like, it, nothing really matters. We defeat him, we sort of want to contain him, and then we become him. I love that. That's like OG Diablo for me. I don't know. I feel like, I feel like Diablo was just always... It, I mean, to an extent, I guess it's kind of like, I'm 14 and this is deep. Right? Uh, but... With Diablo, the story was always just so metal and dark. That it was like straight up, yeah, we, we fight through demons and demons and demons. But is this, like literally the, at the core of Diablo, it's an eternal conflict, right? So whenever we find this piece, it is like, Diablo was contained, dot dot dot, for now. And then eventually it, he just breaks back through. Right? It's sort of like what you're fighting for doesn't really matter. But we keep doing it because it's just like... I don't know, I love that. I love that it's not like some, oh yeah, we fought, we contained him, and everything was, was groovy. I just love that universe. It's not some tropey thing of, he was locked away for, for all of time, and then someone, this complex character, wanting to do X, Y, and Z. It's just like, no. No. It's just a ultra giga chat demon broke through. Uh, and is now attacking all of uh, the entire world again. We need to kill him again. Go do it. And you're like, okay. I will do it. I'm sure it'll be fine. And then you do it. And then you become Diablo. And then it's like, oh. And then you start Diablo 2. And you go after Diablo. And you kill like all of the prime evils. And at the end, it's like, again. The soul stones were destroyed. And there was peace. For now. <laughs> and then it's just like, yeah. Because sequels, lol. I mean, yeah, but I also love it. I also love it. I'm telling you, if you like go back and listen to to the to all the Diablo lore, like story uh, stories like that just aren't really written anymore, unfortunately. That's why I always really dislike Diablo 3. Because I think it just strayed way too far from the original, uh, original vibe of the Diablo story. And visually, I didn't like it either. I don't know if you've seen it, but the uh, the official um, Diablo YouTube channel, they put out these really cool narrated videos of basically a short version of all the Diablo lore. It's like, all together, it's probably like 30 minutes, maybe? It recaps basically everything in a very, very short form. The gist of it is genuinely like what I said. Um, the hero defeated Diablo, became Diablo, Diablo was defeated again. And then, eternal armies raised once more, and the war just waged on and on and on. It's great. I love it. It's so bleak. Spin to win. I won. Uh, alright. Let's hop on over to there. Ooh! Level up. All right, let me see what I'm missing now. Um. Mm -hmm. Should I do booming voice? Or should I do this? Six enemies. I'm just wondering, like, how realistic is that I'm going to... Oh, fine, I'll do this. If I'm surrounded by a lot of dudes, my DPS will be insane. There we go. Great. Why am I losing frames? What's happening? Why am I on 40 FPS? Won't 
feels much better. I'm sure it's fine. I think I know how to talk with my mother again. No, like seriously, why am I dropping frames all of a sudden? Is is something loading? Uh we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. I'm sure it'll be back to normal eventually. Is this the boss room? I don't think so. This is where we left off. The breeze coming from the Black Lake. Do you feel it? Let's hurry. is only a husk. My spirit must pass on. And you must let me go. Mother, no. I need you. You need to move on, Magpie, without me. But I can help you one last time before I go. Please do. Please give us the thingy. Have the divine blessing. Give us a bridge. The old blood is the necessary key. I hate it whenever that happens in movies and TV shows. Like people just freaking cut their entire hand open. I'm just thinking like, oh my god. People do it so cinematically. In reality, I'd be like, oh no. Can you imagine how much a paper cut hurts. This dude is just cutting his hand open. What a Giga Chan. What a Giga Chan. <laughs> he feels like Wolverine. Mayrell. The way is open. We have to go. And like I don't get why people like I know it looks badass, right? That you cut like your your hand. Why why do you do it here though? Why not do it like out the back of your hand or something? What a mad lad. I have to take care of my mother. But it's not over yet. Not for you. Oh, trust me, it's never over for me. I'm gonna be I'm gonna keep going for a long, long time. It'll be great. I'll be back at the vault. Alright. Right. There we go. Alright, this is certainly the last part I did in the beta. I am 100% certain of that. Yes, this is the last quest. So after this, after this boss, 100% of it is completely new. Keep spinning. Keep spinning. There we go. That's how you play this game. Uh, what did I pick up? What's this? Let's spin my way through these. Very nice. And I think this should basically be it. Is the poison poison really weak? Um, I mean, I guess it ramps up later on, but like right now, I can literally out heal it. Yeah, it's like no big deal. Normally, of course, you'd have to move out of it, but I think this early on, it's like, you can just tank it. It's no big deal. And I think I have some poison resist as well. Yeah, I have 6% poison resist plus 6.2% poison resist. This should be... Yep, there it is. The healing well, which means it's time for a boss fetch. Do I have any potions? No, I do not. Thought I heard something. Never mind. All right, time to pop off. Okay, 
Okay, that I do want to move out of. That actually does hurt. Move out of that. And this is where playing melee kind of bites you in the ass, because it's kind of miserable. Because, like, if you're ranged, this mechanic literally does not matter. You know what? This isn't looking that well. This might actually be our first death. I don't think I have that. I just don't think I have the damage to kill him, really. Maybe. Maybe, we'll see. Dodge out of that. Oh! There we go. Dodge out of that. Let's go dodge out of that. Uh, give me some healing potions. Yes, thank you. Move out of the cone. Dodge the wave. Move out of that. Uh, those are some more waves. Heal. Alright. Start spinning. Keep spinning. Don't stop spinning. Okay, I'm on my last health pot. Move out of the cone, move out of the wave, move out of the trash. Okay. Alright, I think we're dead. I think we're dead. Oh, I don't think I'm going to DPS him far enough to actually regen. Yes, I'm dead. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. Oh, no. This is where we die. Unless he does a super thing, this is where we die. Dodge that. Move out of that. I'm dead. I'm so dead. I'm so... Yeah, I'm dead. Okay. Okay. We need to head back to town. We're gonna head back to town. We're gonna upgrade some stuff. And then we're gonna one-shot him. We're gonna return to town. We're gonna upgrade some stuff, and it'll be no big deal. Literally no problem whatsoever. Alright, so... Let me see if I can craft some stuff. Um... Cold resistance... Armor, thorns, dodge, shadow resist... I'll just do armor, I guess. Let's craft a couple of those, and then let's... Refine resources. Uh... Whatever. Let's not do that for now. Alright, then let me go and uh, upgrade some of my stuff. Hello. What will it be? So let me just, um... Salvage... Directly in inventory, salvage, 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 salvage. I'm just gonna salvage all of it. It's 
All right. Uh, and now let us upgrade this. There we go. Let's upgrade my chest piece. Unexpected. Uh. So what's that? Veiled crystals. Okay, let me salvage. I guess I'll salvage this as well. Whoops. Salvage that. There we go. All right. And I'll upgrade. I mean, I think upgrading these is cheap, so I'm just might as well. It is a bit of a waste since I'll replace them very quickly, but... Alright, so we have those. And that's that. Okay. Thirty-nine thousand, though. I can't buy that. I don't have the money. Alright. We'll attempt it again. We'll attempt it again. If we fail, then we might need to level a bit more. Um, all right. You mean kick his ass? Yes. Exactly. Alright, let's pop the potion, and let's get back into it. Actually, not that great. Pop that. And he's gonna be invulnerable. Move to the barrier. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, that was my bad. I should have moved out of that. I didn't. Move out of that. Heal. Move out of that. Pop my buffs, then pop off. All right, move out of that. All right, move out of that. Heal, dodge the wave, Do uh, or run into it. That also works. Pop my buffs, then spin. Invulnerable, move to barrier. Spin. Dodge that, dodge the waves. Alright, pop my buffs. Spin. Dodge the waves. Dodge the puddles. Heal. 
dodge the shadow thingies. Pop buffs. Keep spinning. Oh, that was a lot of damage. All right, keep spinning. Move out of that. Bob buffs. That's the, that's the shadow thing, run. Heal, spin. All right. All right. Oh, that's the shadow thing. Not perfect. Not terrible either. Okay. That's last phase. I'll move to the barrier. Nice. Move out of that. Pop buffs. Spin. Uh, dodge that. Or don't. Most of it at least. Move out of that. Heal. Pop buffs. All right, I think we got him. Uh, run away from that. Last potion, though. Last potion. I think I, I think I can finish him off. Bob buff spin. He's gonna be dead. Okay, play it safe. I'm on my last potion. Oh, uh, that's the shadow stuff. Run away. Charge him. And it dropped two shinies. Both gloves. I hate this game. Why do you give me two shinies? Why? Legendary. I hate this game. I hate this game. Why do you give me a legendary? But it's a whirlwind legendary, but it's a whirlwind legendary. It's a whirlwind legendary. You know what? I can live with that. I can live with that. Hello. How did I forget about this? this was it just a punishment? Jesus Christ! A stronger man would have refused Pyramid had mech? Basically! <laughs> Yikes! He's so dark. I repented. Do you think I was too late? No, not too late. 
The light has come to carry you home. Oh, I love the music so much. The music is so good. The goat! The goat! Ooh! Shiny! Nice. Well then. Goodbye. Uh, so where am I supposed to go now? I guess, I guess deeper down? Oh, I didn't do- I didn't see this. I don't know if you would have chosen to stand beside me in this new world. But I would have saved your place just the same. And now, wasn't this trailer material? I don't think. Oh, I mean, not definitely the main trailer. It might have been one of the later ones, but I kind of purposely didn't watch many of the later ones. I haven't seen this. This is my first time seeing this. This key unlocks more than the doors of hell. It unlocks our path to the future. A future made possible because of the price you paid. I still want to know why she has hetero heterochromia. What's up with the eyes? Well, there it is. There it is. Hello. Vigo wanted you to have this. Oh. Oh. He was a good man. And you left. Was she even there? Did you meet her? Already gone by the time I arrived. There is more. I can see that. Look at my pants. I look so weird. I'm just this badass barbarian with like bright green pants. She's the only one who got what they wanted. Hiral. She came seeking the Haradrim of legend. Seeking hope. She found neither. But her part in things was far from over. In truth, we would need her more than she needed us. Didn't seem that way at the time, though. For anyone. Inarius proved to be just as unreliable as I'd feared. His self-obsession had driven him to murder his son, Rathma. And from the corpse left behind, Lilith had taken a key to hell. Where would she use it? Well, I wonder where she would use it. <laughs> we could only depend on ourselves to find out. Alrighty then. That's act one, I think. Ooh, ring. Uh, ring? Ah, uh, let's do that. Nice. Uh, I think that's act one. Yes, that is act one. Uh, and barbarian master- oh, Jesus Christ! What? That is very, very far. How the hell am I supposed to go over there? I mean, I have a quest there, so I need to go there anyway. Okay, I guess I'll do the barbarian quest first, then. It's a far, far, far away, though. 
I have no idea how big the map actually is, like in terms of walking across it, but it definitely looks huge. So we'll see. Looks like quite a journey, especially at that pace. Yeah, because I mean, I still don't. Ooh, that's a that's a bonus event. That's a bonus event. Wait, how do I get there? Especially because I still don't have a mount, right? Ooh, that's a one-handed axe, though. All right, what's this? I want to see what this is. Wayward soul. All right. If I need to escort you somewhere, I'm sorry, I'm out. Fine. Fine. I'll do it. Fine, I will escort you. If you give me something cool, that is. Um, I'm about to die. Um. As I said, you know what? Screw that spirit. I don't give a fuck what he's doing. I'm I'm leaving. <laughs> bye bye. I have barbarian things to do. He can figure it out himself. Ooh, another bonus objective. What's this? If this is an escort, I'm out. No, this isn't an escort. This is just slay enemies. That I'm very good at. Slay as many enemies as you can before the time runs out. Oh, I'm so good at that. You can just come back over leveled. Uh, I think to an extent, yeah, but I'm pretty sure the world scales with you. So not really. Because all these mobs are the same level as me. I think they scale with me. I think I can outgear them, but not like outlevel them, if that makes sense. All right, there we go. Give me a shiny. You didn't give me a shiny. It's an upgrade though, I'll take it. All right, let's continue on. No more distractions. We've got a long way to go. No more distractions. I keep, I keep spinning forward until my enemies are destroyed, basically. That's the vibe that I'm going for. All right, so I guess I can use this as my single target damage. <laughs> Just whack them over the head. Nice. There's a lot of shinies. That's a lot of shinies. That's an upgrade. And that's an upgrade. It's a one-handed sword, though. Yeah, I don't know if I should be sticking to, like, one type of weapon, or I should just be allowing it to switch all the time. Because I think, like, my one-handers right now are, like, just more powerful. But I don't have them leveled up, right? So I don't know. These aren't NPCs. No, these are players. You know how I said I think this quest will be in a town? I'm starting to doubt that. Are you for real? There's no waypoint here. Well, whatever the case, I'm not going to do the quest now. Let's go do the barbarian one. It looked underground at first. It, it did. It still feels kind of underground, but there's rain, so... I don't think it is underground. <laughs> Keep spinning. The top one is being attacked, but I kind of need to take care of this guy. There we go. Give me a shiny. Shinies! We got some shinies. Let's see what the shinies are. That's a good shiny. Um, plus seven to all stats. Damage over time, though. Uh, I don't want that, because this is Whirlwind. I definitely want to keep these. There we go. Shinies! Even more shinies. Very nice. Very nice. Let us see what shinies we got. I don't want that, though. This is this seems like much better. Please tell me there's a waypoint. Oh my god, there's a waypoint. There's a waypoint. We've made it. We've made it. 
Okay, let me get to a merchant. It's the first thing I want to do. Nah. We're doing fine right now. I see you are a child of Arios, yet you bear no crest. Have you no tribe? No, I do not. I'm an outcast. Your tribe scattered by the fall of Mount Ariat. We oxen have been fortunate. Okay, while they're RPing, I need to put my watch on the charger. Hold on. If you Literally at three your strength to ours, seek counter to our town. She will show you what is needed. Oh dear, oh dear. Alright. Uh Alright. If you wish to join your strength of- oh, hold on, what was the chat? See Katra north of the town, she will show you what is it uh, you need. Alright, cool. Alright, let us head north. And see what this is about. I don't know what this unlocks, I literally have no idea. But it's supposed to be some sort of barbarian mainline quest, so we'll do it. Wait, what? No, that's Katra. There's someone else. No, that's her. Is, is that line bugged or something? Because she keeps saying it. Even though I'm still in the middle of the quest. Maybe it's some sort of other quest, I don't know. Oh, it's another- it's another spinning barbarian. He's also mastered the technique of spin. It's a, it's a literal just drop down, it's not a cave. It's just a hole. It's not a cave, it's just a hole. <laughs> Tribe. I will wait here for you to return. Or until the sun rises again. I'll be fine, sun the sun won't rise. I'll be fine. I'll go in there. I'll kill this beast, whatever it is. And we'll be perfectly fine. Look at this dude. What the hell is that? Why the fuck does it have some shadow buddies? I mean, it is shadow enhanced, so... Well, anyway, it's dead. As I said, an absolute giga chat. You said you'd wait on the outside. What are you doing here? And what a great, ugly thing it is. Glorious. Oh my god, I, I think I know what I'll get. I think they're going to make me either a chest piece or a helmet with the beast. That'd be badass. I would not be against that at all. There's a, small <laughs> There's a small cave nearby. There's a small cave nearby. It's just like the only thing I'm hearing all the time. All right, screw these guys. I'm just going to run past. Bye-bye. Oh no, that's a lot of dudes. Okay, fine, we'll kill all these dudes. Spin! Nice. Why did I run into more dudes? Don't ask. Run. Just run. Just run. Just run. Stop running into more dudes and just run. Oh my god, there's gonna be more people up here. Oh my god, yes. I'm so dead. It's a chest! I need that chest. Okay, we need we need to approach this tactically. Something dropped me a health potion. Please. Oh my god, it's more dudes. It's sweaty gamer time. Oh my god, why are there so many dudes? I need that chest. There was a big glowing chest. I'm gonna go back for that chest. I'm going for that chest. I don't know what it is, but I need it. Is it on the map? It's not on the map. Must be good then. Big glowy chests always contain something cool. Must do. Ooh! Very nice. 
So I think we'll be back to- yep, two-handed. Nice. Alright, there it is. Alright. What is this? It's locked. Where the hell do I get a whispering key? Do you have a whispering key? I'm so shocked and sad. There's a loot goblin though. Come over here. Don't let him get away! Oh my god, there's another- there's another silent chest. <gasps> Legendary! That's good. That's very good. We like that. We like that. We enjoy that. There it is! There it is! Okay. 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 We're good. We're good. This is good. This is very good. Plus one rank of whirlwind. Oh, but it's like it's replacing my legendary. Yeah, no, let's not do that. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. I'm actually stupid. You actually needed to pick this? Oh my god, I'm so dumb. What's my most powerful weapon? It's the sword, right? Oh my god. Oh my god. No, oh, but I can just swap it. This is why you pay attention to prompts. And you're just not a moron. But anyway, I did this. And that's it. I guess. So now I need to make it back here. And do act two. Which is back there. But let's, just not, let's just not worry about that. I planned that. That was on purpose. The game was just too easy, so I thought I'd make it a little bit harder for myself. Didn't, like, no shot, there's not a waypoint there. I must have just missed it. So there really is no waypoint here. That is mega odd. Uh, let me, let me, let me, uh... Wait, what? What was that? What did I just salvage? Well, it's gone. <laughs> I, I might have just salvaged something really good, but oh, I mean, it's gone. It is what it is. It's gone now. It's gone now. It's gone now. If it was something good, well, you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. I'll be fast. I'll tell him that everything is bad. Lilith is back. We're gonna be- we're all gonna die. It's gonna be horrible. That's all he needs to hear. my boy you know i i found some of my old horadric tomes stay here and we can go through them together i can take some with me we have a visitor this discussion is not over is there something you need i have a message from lorath well there's a name from another life has the old man finally come down from the mountain? With a warning. An ancient evil walk. Well, basically, yeah, exactly what I said. It's like, it's really bad. Lilith is back. And we're going to be, we're all going to die. And do you know this? How? Did you and Lorath discover something of interest? Perhaps this is all connected to what you saw, father. <clears throat> yes, I was just getting to that. There was an incident at my estate. Uh, probably best if we discuss it there. Go and have a look around for yourself. I'll meet you shortly. And then we can talk more. As okay. for your request, get to Bracetech. And be careful. Stay close to the other knight's penitent. I will. Don't worry. Okay. 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 So, where do I need to go now? Okay. Why the hell is there not a waypoint here? Also, hold on. Well, let me just make sure that I'm not being a dumb dumb again. Let me just go to the, uh, to the stable master and see whether or not I can buy a mount. I don't think I can, because I think I need to unlock it. I think it's unlocked through the main quest. 
And I think it's only around like level 30. I'm going to go over there and just make sure. Because if I could have a mount this entire time. Yeah, okay. Okay, so yeah, so I, I don't have a mount just yet. We're good. We're good. Yeah, let's just go in the, let's just go in the weird basement. Why not? I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> okay. Okay. This is another pro-life tip. If you're sitting in your basement and a mirror or a statue or something starts talking to you, run. <laughs> do not do what this dude did. Just don't. Oh my god, the mocap. Return to the darkness from whence you came. I said away. Her pulling on his lip was just like what? That was really good. Spooky. 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 And I don't know why my cutscenes are locked to 30 FPS. I'll sort it out later. Oh. Everyone's dead. Brilliant. That's why there was no waypoint here. Well, that explains it. <laughs> Defeat Goatman attackers. Okay. I can do that. All right, let's bunch them up. All right, let's see what these shinies are. Another upgrade. God damn. Well, already then. Let's pop on. Let's pop on over and give them a wizard. Oh god, so far away. Again. Oh, there's a waypoint. There's a waypoint. There's a waypoint. Anyway, I think I think I'll leave it there for today. Not today. Again, I'll be back in the evening. But for now. I've, I've been playing for five hours straight. I want to go get some food. And I want to do a little bit of work. And then we'll be back. Sometime in the evening. For a few more hours. I'm loving it so far. I love spinning. I love being a Beyblade. Actually, before I leave. Let me go and upgrade my potions. Otherwise, I'll forget. I'll upgrade my potions. Then, then, then I'll go away. For a bit. For a bit. All right. All right. Thank you for joining me for now. And I'll be back in a couple hours. Uh, not in a couple hours, probably like five or six hours. Uh, and then we'll pro probably not five hours, but we'll uh, we'll do another couple hour stream. But yes, that's it for now. And I will see you uh, a bit later on. All right. Have a wonderful time. Bye bye.